standing on the bare ground, my head bathed by the blithe air and uplifted into infinite space. All mean egotism vanishes. I become a transparent eyeball. I am nothing. I see all. The currents of the universal being circulate through me. The name of the nearest friend sounds then foreign and accidental. To be brothers, to be acquaintances, master or servant is then a trifle and a disturbance. I am the lover of uncontained and immortal beauty. In the wilderness, I will find something more dear and connate than in the streets or villages. In the tranquil landscape, and especially in the distant line of the horizon, man beholds somewhat as beautiful as his 